day two begins. Day one haven't been quite successful, but today I haven't brought the tripod. So you get to see the before and the during snapshots and then the after. Because doing while videoing takes two to three times longer than it does to just do. So I have discovered. better. Yesterday Today A lot of people have mentioned potential firewood. As you can see, these are cut the lengths that I can shift, not cut the lengths that are going to fit anybody's firebox. I'm pretty sure my next door neighbour will let anybody who wants to pick among the pile and then recut it to fit have their fill of it. But firewood's just not that scarce in these parts. Anybody who's got a forest has got half a forest of dead trees. Anybody who's after firewood, they cut it to the length of the firebox the first time. Which means lots more cuts. Quite honestly, lots more fuel, lots more time. Whereas I just feel like being able to drive to town along my super highway be twelve hundred dollars. In what they call dirty road base and front end loader time to make a driveway out of it. Full twenty years ago. And as I mentioned uh, walk about sixteen the leprechaun 29 years ago when I bought the bit of paper that said I'm responsible for the 100 acres I've been expecting these three trees at some point to fall down across my driveway <coughs> Don't know when it's going to happen Two out of three of them are now on the ground As long as the third one doesn't land on me I'm just going to be pleased with that Actually, good result just have a chainsaw and be prepared to spend a couple of days clearing the driveway when it happens because it will it's inevitable but it's indeterminate you know like the final firestorm in global warming taking Australia back to being a failed state third world nation but it's coming that much is undoubted Wobbles online to YouTube. Second channel. Bye.